I have docked with the Belsavis space station. Roth, Belsavis has been the Republic's best kept secret, hidden even from the hand. The disappeared reappear. The planet has been a prison for the galaxy's most dangerous criminals and many presumed dead Sith agents. It houses the blood of the betrayer. I struggle to understand what he says. Servant 2 has been exposed to the Emperor. He now sees the galaxy differently than most. It was Servant 2 who realized what was happening on Belsavis. When the prison manifests were leaked, Varus discovered that Darth Ekkage, his sister, was alive and imprisoned there. The blood of the betrayer. Darth Ekkage was a member of the Dark Council and leader of the Sith Infiltrators. If she is reunited with Varus, many more will bow to him. If she's Varus's blood, I will destroy her. The betrayer's blood must be spilled. To crack the door to Belsavis, the Emperor has directed the Guardsmen to coordinate extractions from the prison planet. A clever cover. Get authorization to shuttle to the surface and compel the Imperials to reveal Barriss's agents. Stop them from releasing Darth Ekkage. Next. Name, please? Kateo. Let's see. Oh. oh. there you are. Killer Kateo. Butchered an entire squad of Republic soldiers with... A shiv? That's me. Someone get this man a blaster! Welcome to the Imperial Army, Kateo. If there's anything else we can get you, maybe something dull and rusty, just ask. I seek information about a mission to break out Darth Ekkage and her assassins. That's Lord Melikoth's mission. He and his team have been permitted to venture deep within the Belsavis prison. The order came directly from Darth Barris, and you don't have clearance to know more. I'm not leaving until you tell me everything. I will not betray my orders. Colonel, what are you doing? We're in the presence of a Sith Lord. It is our duty to aid in any way. Stand down, Captain O'Clart. I will not, my lord. Lord Melikost invaded the prison this morning with a squadron of commandos. He's placed them throughout this level of the prison to cover his descent and to secure the area for his exit. Melikost will never leave Belsavis. Captain, this Sith means to stop Darth Barriss's mission. It seems you just aided an enemy. It's not our place to judge between Sith, Colonel. We don't know exactly where Melikost is headed, my lord, but Lieutenant Cade, the leader of his commandos, might. Trouble is, Cade's men stationed in this sector will report any activity. If you're unwelcome, they'll warn him and Melikost. Everyone under Melikost's command will be destroyed. You've just signed a death warrant for your fellow soldiers. That's treason. I'm reporting you both to high command. Darth Barris will know what has transpired here. I cannot allow that. Your decisiveness is enviable. I will cover your back, Sith, and Darth Barris will be none the wiser. You have my word. If Cade's commandos don't harm him, you'll surprise him in his bunker. He'll tell you where Lord Melikost is headed. Men, I'm assuming command of operations. First things first, dispose of Colonel Trill. About time. I'll taste your blood. Bravo five five three, do you copy? This is command center. Report. Bravo five five three, do you copy? Your units are gone, Lieutenant. What? Why? What's the meaning of this? My men and I are here in support of Lord Melikost. If you're responsible for this, you will answer to him. No, he will answer to me. Tell me where Melikost is, and I'll gladly present myself to him. Damn these Sith games. Lord Melikost proceeded into the high security sector of Belsavis. 
He's after the records room at the Blown Republic prison there. He seeks the location of a former Dark Council member. Darth Eckage is the Dark Council member he plans to free. If you say so, I'm not privileged to such details. And when it comes to Sith business, I prefer to be kept in the dark. All right, what now? Do I have to kill you to keep you from warning Lord Melikost that I'm coming? Absolutely not, Sith. I mean, my lord. I shall report it to Lord Melikost as scheduled, and not before. A word, please. I am Jedi Master Samanik Timms. I know you're there. I can feel your presence. What's more, I know who you are. Many years past, I was the Padawan of Master Noman Kar. He and I forged a bond through the Force. I know about your confrontation with Master Kar and what you did to him. I should have killed that miserable old man when I had the chance. He's never been the same, and he no longer communes with the Force. Ever since you defeated Carr and took Jaysa Wilson, the Jedi Council has been keeping track of you. We know you are no longer aligned with Darth Barriss, and are in fact here to stop Lord Melikost from freeing Darth Ekkage. Nice to see you Jedi aren't always in the dark. You'll find we are not as inept as your former master may have suggested. It's a dead end, Sith. To follow Lord Melikost, you need information from the computers in this room, but the door has been fused. I came for the same reason. I got the information, but Lord Melikost's commandos trapped me in here. Outmatched by mere commandos. Not your proudest day. Oh, I don't know. There were quite a lot of them, and I held my own. Our combined strength, striking the door from both sides simultaneously, could break the physical seal. Trouble is, there's a fail-safe force field that makes even that impossible. Now, if you were to take out that force field... I don't appreciate dramatic pauses. There are several power stations feeding this installation. Destroy them, and the force field will not engage. Then you and I can break through this door, and you can access the prisoner reports. Stop talking. I'll do it. Glad to hear it. Scour the area and destroy the power stations. Then return and start banging on the door. We'll work it out. I'll be waiting. After all, where am I going to go? I have returned, Jedi. The power stations are down. Great. With the force field down, we should be able to break the door open. On three. One, two, three! Well done, Sith. Now, wait a moment. You're Jaysa Wilson, aren't you? I used to be. Any regrets, my dear? Joining up with this rogue? Absolutely not, Jedi. Not when I get to meet and destroy obnoxious fools like you. We have more important matters to attend to. That we do, Sith. Now before you think to fight me, Sith, I suggest you inspect the computer banks in here.
I'd say they've seen better days. Hmm, still smoking. I wonder who could have destroyed them. You just signed your death warrant. Don't be hasty. I did it to make sure no one else sent by Darth Barris could succeed. That is, after you and I stopped Lord Melikost. Now I'm the only one who knows where to go. Our goals are one, even if our motives vary. I suggest a partnership. Tell me where Darth Ekage's cell is, and we can part ways. Sorry, I can't be sure you won't attack me once you know. All I'll tell you is that we're headed for deep prison. The exact location of Darth Ekage's cell remains my secret. In good faith, I'll point you to her assassins. You can make sure they remain locked up while I get access to the deep prison. For the time being, I won't cut you open. I'm thankful. You'll see, it makes sense to do it this way. You might get the assassins to back down without a fight. Me? Not so much. Here are the coordinates. Follow me when you're done, and we'll get together and face the darts. It really will take both of us.